If you're a DSLR owner, the lens that came with your camera is great for getting started, but eventually you will grow out of it. So if you're ready to purchase a new lens, I have a few recommendations on exactly how to go about it. Hands down, my favorite lens is the 50 millimeter 1.8 fixed lens. It's great for portraits, food photos, and still life. It is a prime lens or fixed lens, so it doesn't zoom, which means you'll have to get really close to your subject in order to frame up. But the trade-off is huge. It's a fast lens with a wide aperture, which means super sharp photos even in low light. The best part is that it's only $100, and that's about as cheap as it gets. When you're shopping for a portrait lens, what you want is a lens that won't distort your subject. You want the person to look like they do to the human eye. You also want that really cool blurry background effect. On a full-size sensor camera, like the Canon 5D, Get a lens with a focal length of 80 millimeters to 100 millimeters. On a crop sensor camera, like this one, that translates to about 50 millimeters. If you want to go any shorter than 50 millimeters, your subject will start to look a little too stretched out, so stick with this range. For food photography, you don't necessarily need a zoom lens. Instead, go in the prime lens like the 35mm 1.4. At this focal length, the shots will be just wide enough to get a crisp photo of an entire plate of food without distorting it. Since it's fixed, you will have to move around to get closer or wider, but really, that's a part of the intimacy of food photography. When you're traveling, there's a good chance you'll want a lens that'll take great landscape photos letting you capture wide, sweeping shots of whatever exotic place you're in. If you have to choose one lens to take with you on a trip, the 18 to 35 millimeter 1.8 is the way to go. At its widest, you'll get great sweeping views of landscape, and it's still great for close-ups of food and portraits of people. All around, this is a great go-to lens.